G'day Ben. G'day Jim. Good to see you. Thanks for coming down. Oh, no worries. How's the fishing been? Uh, it's not too bad. Yeah? Uh, for sort of late March, yeah, but we'll go out and have a look, see how we go. Cool. The boat's going good? The boat's great. No worries. Let's get into it, eh? Nice one. Hey. First Port Phillip base. Is that for the gym? Fantastic. It's only a little one though. Yeah. Do you want this one, Jim? Ben's on too. Yep. I uh, lost him. Today we're out in Port Phillip Bay in uh, Melbourne, Victoria. We're uh, fishing for uh, Pinky Snapper. I'm here with my old mate Ben Sandman. Now you'll notice uh, another video we did on the Fishing World website. We went to the Honda factory in Melbourne and we spoke to the guys. Oh, just had a little bite there. We spoke to the guys about the technical aspects of uh, modern four-stroke engines and how the latest developments have really refined these uh, particular engines and made them into uh, superb uh, outboards for, for fishing use. To get a better idea of how uh, that technology actually works out on the water, I arranged to come and have a bit of a fish with Ben. Ben's got a BF200 on the back of his uh, Haynes Hunter. And uh, this is the, the latest model. It's the one equipped with the blast uh, technology that we spoke about with the Honda technicians at the factory. And uh, I guess you'd call it probably the latest, greatest uh, sort of um, Honda four stroke in terms of technology and refinement. And Ben, you know, you've used this engine for what, a year or so now? Um, what are your sort of initial impressions on modern four stroke outboards? Well, first and foremost is the reliability of four stroke engines and their fuel economy. Mm -hmm. um, in regard to this particular Honda outboard with the, the blast in it, you would have felt that this morning when we're taking off out of the hole, yeah. a quick sort of advance of the throttle, it really kicks in and takes off to lift the boat out quickly. And I guess too that the, you still, even though you're getting that good performance, you're still getting that essential four stroke really good fuel economy? Definitely. I mean, as this this whole blast technology, it sort of richens the air fuel ratio, mm -hmm. um, right, right, low down. But once you sort of get through that, that blast section, another hit. Uh, once you get through there, the, the fuel really drops down again, levels out, yep. in what they yep. call eco mo, mm -hmm. an economy controlled motor. And you see the fuel consumption drop right down there. You can see on the Lowrance screen with the engine plugged into it. One of the interesting things I noticed about this style of fishing we're doing here in Port Phillip Bay is you know, you're, you're sounding out schools of fish and then sort of motoring around them, checking them out with your sounder and then anchoring up. Another hit. Yeah. Why don't you actually Just keeps up? coming back. Hook up, mate. I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> you're actually you're sounding out fish, you're motoring around them, then you then position yourself and anchoring. So I'm thinking uh, that the quietness would have a big impact on the fishability of the boat then. Because if you had like a, a really noisy old style uh, engine, you know, we're not in deep water here, what, 20 metres or something like that? It's oh, not, not, e not even, yeah, not 17 even. metres. So yeah. do you think that has a, um, oh, I'm getting a few bites too. Yeah. Uh, do you think that has an impact as well? For sure. I mean, you saw that boat come around earlier, that older boat with a two-stroke on it. It made mm. so much noise and we sort of crept in here. You wouldn't have even known the engine was going if yeah. there was someone sort of looking on. Yeah, yeah, no, that's pretty interesting stuff. Well, mate, we couldn't get a better afternoon, could we? Yeah. <laughs> Time it well. Yeah, fantastic. I just hope those bigger snapper come on as the sun sinks down a little bit, eh? Hey? Let's hope so. Only a little penny, but still not oh, yeah, bad. Not bad, bad, not bad at all. Bring him over. Beautiful. Yeah. All right. Oh, on plastic as on well. Plastic. So, nice one, mate. Good stuff. Right in the corner of the mouth. 